We are at Cloudland Canyon State Park. This place is really yes, well built let's right go here. hiking and see some views. In case you haven't noticed, we're not in Florida anymore. We're up here in Tennessee. Thought we might visit my family and do a little bit of hiking. So let's get to it. I really can't say enough how thankful I am for Cracker Barrels these days. I know, right? <laughs> we stayed the night uh, just north of Atlanta. Well, we couldn't get out of there without the ornament. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was so cute though. I mean, we have so many memories now at Cracker Barrel. And it's just a reminder of our first year of van life, I think. Yep. We're at Cloudland Canyon State Park. It's a few thousand acres. It's like one of the biggest state parks in all of Georgia, one of the most scenic. Today we're doing the West Rim Trail and it should be about five miles, take maybe three hours to complete. And I'm really hoping we see some beautiful canyon views. I think we will. I'm also waiting for my brother. Do you remember from before when he was just jumping through all the boulders with the epic music? I think that we may actually hear his music before we see him. Yeah, I, that would be I, funny. I have a feeling. <laughs> we were just about to get started on the trail and I look over and I see my brother's truck. Let's go surprise him. Oh my God. What's up? Hey. Hi, What's going on? Hi, Danny. Hey. <laughs> you can go on the Overlook Trail really easy. And you can also take this out and back Sitton's Gulch Trail. So who thinks Sarah should be a park ranger? <laughs> Ooh. One thing we have to be careful about, all of these leaves, and you can trip and kind of twist an ankle, so you gotta be very careful. Let's do this. So this was in the summertime, just a little ways down there. Looks a lot different now. Yeah, so beautiful. Oh, the trail marker looks different this time for Cloudland Canyon. Cool, it's like a little blue diamond. So at one point we'll be over there. We'll see everybody standing here. Beautiful. This is a loop, right? Yeah. Perfect. I like loops. There's actually yurts and cabins right on the trail, so you can just hop out of your yurt and jump right into the trail. They're pretty much, they designed them to where they're all along the trail. Of course, we're going off the trail right now. <laughs> Whoa. I never know what's underneath these rocks. <laughs> Is that actually water down there? I, th I think I hear water. Yeah. Yeah, it's the, uh, the waterfall. I'm always a little slower because I see something and I'm like, ooh, I gotta record that. Ooh. Put up a hammock right here. I don't know if this is very sturdy, oh, actually. <laughs> We're living on the edge. Living on the edge. You can't help you yourself, yourself from fall. fall. No, you don't better. fall. No, don't fall. <laughs> oh, good. Got a lot of people on the trail at the moment. We're doing the West Rim today. I think we're in for a workout. It's a lot of steps, but it's gonna feel good. It's the clothing shuffle. I'm already getting hot. This feels good. So since we're not gonna get to see the waterfall trail today, I think we're gonna go walk down there and at least take a look at what it looks like. We're taking a few trails down to the water. And some rhododendron. I bet this is really pretty in the summertime. All the flowers. Living it up when you're going down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. This is an Aerosmith um, trail. <laughs> <laughs> it's very slippery. We all get down here, we're gonna walk. Whoa! <laughs> Told you! <laughs> Going down. Oh, sheesh. Are you gonna end up in the water? Well, he does know about secret waterfalls. Oh, yeah. The one waterfall that I named yeah. Diamond Falls, I, I loved it. Beautiful. This is actually, the side trail takes you to the top of one of the main waterfalls that people come to see. So there's a bunch of people sitting at the bottom and you can see it from here. So we have to check that out. Just be careful, it's very slippery. And 
and bam, it's Cherokee Falls. It's a short hike to see where those people are. Every time we get on the trail, it's always such a good reminder. We kind of get lost, you know, in everyday work, on the computer, social media. It's just nice to be able to stop and look around and listen to the sounds. there I'm good. all right I gotta remember where they stepped <laughs> so I don't fall down oh I see oh that is ice cold Gosh, I've been running for my life. You're about to witness Cloudland Canyon's two most dangerous predators. I'm hiding behind this tree. Here they come. That was a side trail down by the water, but we gotta catch back up to the rim trail up here at this bridge. So this is the point where we must leave the water. Say goodbye to the beautiful stream and water. Bye, bye water. We're going uphill, we're going the ridge line, the rest of it will all be ridge line and uh, canyon sites. Oh, there's a cave right ahead. Well, you guys, this is where we're sleeping tonight. That would be awesome. Can we do that? No, I don't think there's camping permitted on the trail. If you're ever caught in a storm, a cave is the safest place. Unless you're at the bottom of a gorge because it could get a flash flood and fill it with water. So climb as high as possible. I see a yurt. So we'll pass by a number of these yurts. If you stay in one of these, then you can start the trail right here. So we've made it to the ridge of the West Rim Trail. It's so cold, you can see all the way across to where we were. Here, wave at him. Yeah, they're waving at us. You can make it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. Sarah, you gotta go down there. He's on his own. Oh my God. Now the only thing he's missing is some epic adventure music. I can cue that. <laughs> Me nervous, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> now you can see how it runs in the family, right? Oh. She's always shaking her head at me. Paul, Paul, get away from that don't waterfall. Do that. Step away from the ledge. Put down the snake. Stop touching that. You don't know <laughs> if that's poisonous. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Cloudland Canyon State Park. It's is so beautiful. beautiful. That was epic. Another dog. Hey, we were looking for a bear. We found two dogs. We just got caught in the middle of that. <laughs> a dog bite. This begins the actual loop. Like, now there's the loop. So what's is everyone, the plan? Is everyone up for doing more? Because that looks like a lot longer. This is the fork. You can either go left or go right. So we're going to get some good views. This is so cool. There's overlooks everywhere. 
It did a great job to make sure that we could see all the best views at all points of this trail. So we just passed a few hikers, like a group of hikers. And I started hearing something like, what is that? And they had like a big boom box, which is a little bit strange, you know, when you're out in nature. I can see if maybe if you're on a long, long trail, like you're hiking across the country, listen to some music, but I don't know. Is that a little bit weird? But for us, we just love the sound of nature, the water, the leaves, and then our footsteps underneath us. Yeah, this right here looks like a Bob Ross. Happy little tree, happy little tree. I love the colors. Ooh, what do you got there? Found an apple in my bag. It's the Macintosh apple, my favorite. And some Beyond jerky. These are made of mung bean and pea protein. Pretty good. Yeah, yeah. It almost seems like yeah. it's gonna rain. All of that coming up from New Orleans. See all that? Whoa. Is that supposed to hit now? It's an armadillo. So cute. Ugh. We made it. We made it. Okay, first thing that comes to mind about this trail. Armadillo. Armadillo. <laughs> <laughs> now let's see what Danny thinks of the same thing. <laughs> first thing that comes to mind. First thing that comes to mind. Now you got me thinking about armadillo. <laughs> First thing that comes to mind about Cloudland Canyon? My best friend Christy who once told me that when she moved here, she came here because she saw it was named Cloudland, the land of clouds. Join us next time. We're parked on a lake in Tennessee where the view couldn't be any better. Getting out on the cold water? Oh, uh, why not? And we'd love for you to subscribe. See you next time for a relaxing adventure on the bay. <laughs>